countries but we are going to move this across we're going to move it across because can you believe it can you believe it it's day 21 absolutely unreal how is everybody doing good morning good evening let me know that you are here you are alive that you are kicking and that you are ready to feel amazing here we go Woo! hi terry okay amazing amazing all right we've got indiana in the house so today we're going to do a full 30 minute workout okay so 30 minute workout and we are going to do some really fun body combat moves and of course i'm going to end us with five minutes of intense body combat abs okay so we're going to start off with just a nice little warm-up just to get ourselves going Okay, so just rotate those shoulders because we are going to use the arms today. We're going to use the core, we're going to use the legs. Everything is going to be engaged and ready to go. Okay, so take it over to the side. That's it. Really stretch up, lift it up. It's a new week, it's a new day, and we are going to feel fire after this. Yes, we're going to get hot, we're going to get sweaty, and we're going to feel very, very merry. All right, bring those shoulders out all the way down to the side. Alfie and Penny are still not awake, but here they are. Here comes Penny. She is now woken up. I told you guys, they only wake up just as we're getting onto the live. Here we go. All right, now stretch it up, reach out to either side. <laughs> Give me a little heads up that you saw Penny coming down the stairs. <laughs> here we go, stretch it out. Woo! And just give yourself a little, I'm here today. Three, two, one, all righty. Okay, so we're gonna keep warming up as we go along, but let's see who we've got coming. We've got so many different amazing countries on here. Incredible, welcome everybody. Everyone's gonna have so much, so much fun today. All right, so we're gonna bring these knees out a little bit wider. I don't think Alfie's made it up yet. You're probably gonna see him down here in a minute. What we're gonna do is we're gonna take it across. That's it, so nice, just keeping those fists right up by your chin and then taking the punch on the diagonal and taking a little bend in the knee and pivot from side to side. That's it. Gonna keep it nice and smooth. So engaging those arms. We're gonna do a little bit of like a burning arm workout as well. I tell you what, my inner thighs are on fire. I'm gonna ask you guys in a minute where you feel your body is the most sore. So yesterday my chest and my back was hurting at the end of the day. Whew, all right, we're gonna take it over just to one side. That's it, take that left arm straight across. Pull that core in nice and tight. Feel the obliques working. Yes, now try and bend down a little bit more and tucking those hips underneath. Squeeze those glutes for me. Yes, here we go. Take it across the body. You're looking strong. You're looking fierce. Three, two, one. Take it over to the other side. Here we go. Penny, you gonna come and join us? Maybe she will. She's in a little crate right now. Here we go. Take it across the body. Now lift up through the chest, up through the core, and then use those obliques to twist. As you come back to that squat, bring it back and that knee out to the side. Here we go. Five, four, three, that's it. Two, one. Come back to the center. Now straight forwards. We're keeping it nice and smooth. So pull up through that core and twist those obliques. That's it, from side to side. Oh, we're looking good, everybody. You're looking strong. That's it, keep going. Now, take it a little bit lower, up and down. Swoop it and take it across. Here we go, pushing those knees out to the side. Yes. Breathe through it. Now, speed it up just a little bit. One, two, that's it, three, four. Really punch it out. Here we go. Laugh through it. Smile through it. Give me that 20% more. Why did you show up today? You showed up because you wanted to work hard. You wanted to get a sweat in. So just stay with this workout all the way through. Don't go anywhere. Push those knees out to the side. Here we go. Five, 
four, three, two, one. Come back right here. Now little pulses out to the side. That's it, pushing that booty back. Bring those fists right in towards your chin. Now sink down just a little bit lower. Here we go, breathe. Come on, push those knees out to the side. My inner thighs are on fire. We got this, last part. Keep those fists up. Now give you some little pulses right here. Squeeze those elbows together. Push those knees out, more out to the side. Here we go. Last part, five, four, three, two, one. And release, all right, we start to feel a little bit warm. Yes, we are. All right, you guys saw Penny come down. We've got people in Seattle, South Africa, Germany, Thailand, India, Czech Republic. Amazing, okay. All right, we're gonna engage those legs. We're gonna take it into a little curtsy lunge and then we're gonna kick out to the side and then tuck in those hips underneath. So bring those fists right up towards your chin. Take it into a curtsy lunge and then kick and tap. That's it, nice and slow. We're gonna get a little bit faster in the second part of this workout, but for now, we are gonna engage the core and we're gonna take it nice and slow. Because, just because things are fast, doesn't mean to say it's always better. Sometimes slow, controlled, and under tension can actually work just as well, all right? So this knee, make sure it doesn't go in, pushing it out to the side, that's it. Squat down, out to the side. Here we go, breathe. Five, little tap to the side. Four, here we go, push that knee out. Three, all the way down. Two, give me one more. And come back over to the other side, here we go. Down, and kick out to the side. Push that knee out, pull that core in nice and tight. Inhale through your nose, exhale everything out. Now sit down even lower in that curtsy lunge. Try and get that leg just a little bit higher. All the time, taking it nice and slow and controlled. Yes. Woo! Out to the side. Push in that knee and take it out. Give me five. Breathe. And here we go for four. Doesn't have to be fast. Here we go. Three. Sit down deeper. Come on. Two. Give me one more. And now just take it in two your curtsy lunges, but stay low to the ground. You see how low this is? You're not getting all the way up. You're pushing that knee out to the side, and we're deciding today. Remember, we're deciding to commit. That's what we're doing, because when you decide to do something, it doesn't happen, but you commit to doing something, and that's what we're gonna do. We're changing the language. We're saying we're committing to being here every day. We're working together, and that together we can achieve amazing things when we support each other. Here we go, take it down to the left. Little curtsy lunges right here for five, four, three, two, one. Over to the other side, take it down. Really push that knee out to the side. Five, four, three, two, one. Come back to the center. We're gonna hold, bring those arms in, and out, keeping that fist. Breathe, squeeze, squeeze that back together. Pull that core underneath so your back is an arch. Now sink down a little bit lower in that squat. An inch or two more. Bring it out to the side and pulse it out. Using those fists, squeeze that back together. Oh yes, looking finey fine everybody. This community has got something going on. Here we go, little pulses. Squeeze that back together, pull the core under. I can see sweat dripping down from my arms. Here we go, breathe. Sink down just a little bit more. Three, two, one. Hold right here and sink down further. Bring it in and out. <laughs> Whoo, how are we feeling? Come on, sink down lower. Keep squeezing. Give me one more, and release. Okay, take a sip of water. Now, what part of your body is hurting right now? Which are you feeling the most burning? I wanna know from you guys. Because I'm pretty sure my, it's my inner thighs and then my chest from those push-ups yesterday on our sexy bag. 
and chest lift workout. Okay. Woo. All right. I love it. Amazing. Let me know which part of your body is feeling the most stiff. I think everybody's probably got a different part of their body. Okay. All right. Woo. Okay, we're going to bring the knee in towards the chest. We're going to ramp up the pace just a little bit. So right here, you're going to bring it straight up, okay? So what you do is you bring your arms over the top of your head and then you just pull straight in, right? As if it's literally how you're like knocking somebody out, right? Obviously, we're not doing that. We're just emphasizing that we're going to reach those arms up right here and then you bring it in towards your chest. So lift up and you're going to bring it straight forward. We're going to take it across the body in a minute, but first of all, we're just going to do it straight up. So lift those arms up. <sighs> get in the zone, get in the game, get in your peak state, and here we go. Bring it in towards your chest and squeeze. That's it. Really, every single movement has to have the same amount of power. Every single movement has to have the same amount of effort. Every single movement deserves to have that full explosion. Here we go. Bring it in. Lift those arms up and crunch. Five, four. Come on, lift those arms up higher. Bring them in nice and close. Three, two, one. Take it over to the other side. So knee goes straight up. Squeeze it in. Pull that core in tight. Lift in those arms and extend. Here we go. Breathe. Five, four, three. Come on, more power. Two. One, give me another set, needs to be better. Five, four, bring it in. Three, two, one. Now just alternate, up and down. Yes, breathe it through. Oh my goodness. Woo! We are on fire today. Yes, we are getting started with a new week. Just three more days after this. Three more days of these lives. And then we'll be celebrating Christmas Day. Bring those knees up to the chest. Now, this time, we're going to bring your palms out. Bring it down. Here we go. Get those arms working. You start to feel the air underneath your hands is actually giving you a little bit of resistance. Pull it in close. Lift those arms up. Five, four, three, two, one. Now take it across the body. Extend those arms out. Crunch it in and extend. Now bring the fist in towards you. Extend those arms nice and long and bring it in. Lift up, squeeze, pull that core in. You're extending, you're lengthening and release. Okay, we're going to take it over to the other side. Let's lift those arms up, bring it in towards the chest in three, two, one. Here we go, bring it in, extend. Just for the last five, four, three, two, one. All right, bring it back to the center. Take a quick sip of water. Oh, I'm getting sweaty today. You feeling sweaty? We're going to take it back into some arms. Okay, you guys feeling it all over. Inner thigh, abs, and back, legs, hamstrings. All right, everyone's feeling it in a slightly different place. Okay, so we're going to bring those fists right here. We're going to undercut from side to side. Now I want you to use your oblique here as well. So as you take it round, think about squeezing that oblique too. Undercut the other way. Here we go, boom. Now give it some power. Give it some welly as we'd say in England, yes. Pull that core engaged and across. Every single rep, every single rep makes a difference. Every single time that we come onto our mat, we get to make a decision, we get to commit to giving it the best workout, undercut. Here we go, we're gonna make a little series of this. Three, two, one. Okay, come back to the center. We're gonna go forwards and backwards, side to side. Here we go, forwards and backwards, to side to side. Forwards and backwards, to side to side. And again, forwards, backwards, side to side. Now just stay right here, side to side. Side to side, bring those fists up towards your chin. Now get those feet as fast as you can. Really quick feet, quick feet, quick feet for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Now take it to your hook. Round we go. Bring in that fist right back towards your chin. Across we go. Breathe. Oh, yes. Come on. What is it that you wanted to get out of today? 
Was it just to have a half ass workout? Or was it to give it everything? To get yourself sweating. Take it across. Use that core. Obliques on fire. Four, three, two, one. Okay, come and bring it back here. We're gonna swoop it up and swoop it down. Take it nice and slow. All the way around. Tucking that core underneath. Pushing under. And here we go. All the way up and scoop. Take it down and lift up. Here we go. Oh yes, everyone. Every single time that you do a move, think how can I make it better than the time before? Just making it that slightly little bit better. Swoop under and tap those hips underneath. Take it even lower and down. Now stay down underneath. All the way through. Push those knees out to the side. Pull that core in nice and tight. Now get down an inch more. Keep those elbows squeezed together. Yes. Try doing that. Here we go. Last five. Four. Three. Swoop. Two. One. Come all the way back to the center. And just sway from side to side. Oh yes. Push those knees out to the side. Keep those elbows lifted. Last part. Come on. Stay down just an inch lower. Give me three. Two, one, and squeeze. All righty. Take a quick sip of water. I think Alfie is still in bed. Not sure where Alfie still is. Okay, we're going to do a little fun little series. So, we're going to add on some choreography. Let's see how you guys are feeling. We've got Diane on the line, Brown's here, Andrea. Amazing. Love seeing all of your names here. Okay. Let's get, we're gonna go into, all right, here we go. Woo! Get yourself ready, shake it off, shake it off, shake it off, shake it off. Okay, we're gonna take it into two punches and then we're gonna take it into a kick on the left side. So punch with your left, punch with your right and then kick out to the left, okay? We're gonna keep adding on, but first of all, let's just remember that part, okay? If I get a little bit complicated, but we got this. Here we go, punch and kick out to the side. Here we go, one, two, kick, come back to the center, little tap over onto the other side, and then kick it out, that's it. Ooh, so always swaying, think sway from side to side. Breathe, pull that core in nice and tight, and kick out, yes, come on. Ooh, just listen, punching two forwards, kicking out with the left, little tap over to the right, and then bring it back in front with those punches. Here we go, listen for the change. We're gonna add something on. Oh yes, kick it out to the side. Give me one, two, and then you're gonna hook it round. Oh yes, and then kick out to the front. So kick, punch, here we go, take it out, and then kick, that's it. So two punches forwards, one hook, little tap, kick out to the side, another tap, punch forward, and hook it, yes, whoo, that's it. Don't forget those extra little steps that can really help you. Now kick it out to the side, little tap with that right leg. Our right leg's gonna be important right here. Take it out and kick. Punch forward, hook it, yes. And kick out to the side. Two punches forward, one hook to the side, and then kick it out. We got this, one, two, yes. Now get a little bit lower. Take it down to your edge and kick it out. We got it, has everybody got it? Everybody's on the same wavelength? Yes, don't remember, don't forget that little right leg. It's super important, it's gonna give you extra little taps. Okay, we're gonna add on. Hook it round, we're gonna kick out, and then we're gonna kick out to the back. Oh yes, double kick. All right, so we've got two punches forward. We've got a hook, we've got another tap out to the side. We've got a kick to the left. Then we're gonna transfer that weight straight over. So we've got a kick out to the back, and then we go straight into that punch. So instead of that little tap this time, the tap is actually gonna extend into a kick out to the side. Got it right? Okay, three, two, one, here we go. Punch, punch, hook it, tap, kick, kick with the right leg, and then punching straight forward, that's it. So what we're doing is we're just taking out that little, that little step, that's all we're doing. Take it out and kick, all right, slower. Punch, punch, hook, tap, kick with the left, kick with the right, and then go back into those punches. That's it, slow again, we're gonna speed it up. Kick it out to the side, kick it out. One, two, three, tap, 
Kick with the left, kick with the right. And let's speed it up, here we go. Take it across the body, tap and kick. Kick it out to the back, punch two forwards. And let's we go, here we go everybody. Come on, breathe through it. Just keep your body moving. If you're like, I don't know what my body is doing, it's doing something different to Rebecca, then no problem. Just keep kicking, keep punching forward. Give me a side hook in there somewhere and then kick it out to the back. One, two, three. <laughs> yes, that's it. Woo, one, two, hook it out. Kick out, kick to the back. Give me one more. Now, can we take it just a little bit quicker? Here we go, one, two, hook. Here, out to the side, kick it out to the back. And release, okay. Did we get it? Are we there? Are we ready to go onto the other side? Quick sip of water. We're gonna come back one more time with that song so we can take it over to the other side. I know it's Monday, it's early here. I'm testing your brain. You're like, what on earth is going on? Here we go, how did you guys do? <laughs> yes, woo, okay. Spread it out, we're gonna take it over to the other side. So we did punching on the left hand first, so we're gonna punch with the right. But first of all, let's just take those punches going forward. We're gonna add on, okay? So all it was was punching, punching, and we're gonna add the side kick first. That's it, let's warm up again. Remember, we're gonna start with the right to the left. That's it, so right and left. Now add that kick in to the side, that right arm, okay? So we're gonna take it over, to right, left, kick it out to the side. Little tap right here, remember that tap. One, two, kick it out, and tap. Same again, right, left, kick with the right, tap with the left. This little tap is gonna be your savior, trust me, otherwise you're gonna be on the wrong foot. Here we go, one, two, take it out to the side, tap with that leg, here we go, that's it, you got it. Kick it out to the side, tap, Punch with the right. Remember, the same leg that you just kicked with is what you're gonna punch forward with. Now, let's take it out. Now, can we add in that hook? One, two, you're gonna hook it round right here, still tapping that foot right here, and then kicking out to the side. Here we go. So it goes one, two, hook, tap, and extend. Another little tap goes here, so we're adding in two taps. So, punch forward, Take it hook round, tap, kick it out, tap, and then forward, that's it. All right, hook it round, give me a tap, extend that leg out, tap here, and punch it forward, pull that core in, kick it out to the side, little tap right here. Remember, this tap is gonna become that other kick. As we transfer over, two punches, hook it round. Now, now you've got it, try and give a little bit more certainty. Hook it, that's it. Kick it out to the side and punch, punch, hook, tap, and kick it out. Remember, tap, punch, punch, hook it, tap, and kick to the side. Yes. All right. Are we ready to add in the next one, the last part of this? We're going to add in that other little kick. Okay. So there it is. You're just going to kick out to the back and then you go straight in. So it's basically instead of the tap, we're going to do that, that kick. All right. Yes, we've got this. Okay, here we go. So punch, punch, hook it, tap, kick it out to the side, kick straight back and straight into those front punches. Woo! Yes, kick it out. Punch, punch, kick it out, little tap. Woo, here we go, you've got this. Now, punching forwards, right, left, hook with the right, tap, kick with the right, kick with the left, and then take it forwards. That's it, kick it out and kick. Punch forward, hook it with the right, little tap, kick with the right, kick with the left, and then take it forward. All right, let's take it slow. Are you ready? So, punch with the right, with the left, hook it with your right, tap out to the side, kick out, and then kick straight back. One more time, right, left, hook, tap, kick, kick, and punch, punch, hook it, tap, yes. Keep it going, two punches, one hook, tap it out to the side, kick it out. One more time, hook it, tap, punch, kick, boom, yes. 
All right. Okay, that's testing my choreography. How did you guys feel? Were you able to keep up with that? Was that okay? We're going to take it down to the ground. We're going to do a quick ab exercise. And then we are going to blast our last final body combat exercise. Here we go. Tap, tap, got it. I love it, Claudia. You are hilarious. Not, not mad. <laughs> this is hilarious. Just caught mad on the other side. Okay. <laughs> Confused on a cannon. <laughs> Look, as long as you're moving your body around, doing something, that's what the most important thing is. Okay, so we're going to bring these. We're just going to punch across. Here we go. Our favorite holiday. Oh, yes. And I can't wait until Wednesday. No, is it Wednesday or Thursday? Uh, Thursday. Yeah, we will be having a little chat afterwards. Little chat, finding out what it is that you guys want for our January calendar. Here we go, punching across. Okay, now come down just a little bit lower. I feel like that was too high. Now just punch it up with the right, across the body. Now keep that left arm straight up by your chin and take it up and across. That's it. Woo, here we go. Now a bit faster. Now keep that face, that face, your head looking straight up at that diagonal and lean back just a little bit further. Punch. Three, two, one. Take it over to the other side. Here we go. Take it across. Left arm straight up. Keep that head in line. We're looking straight up. That's it. Now lean back just a little bit further. We're going to increase that speed. Here we go. And one, two, yes. Woo! And three, two, one. Come all the way up. Punch it up. You're going to punch up to the sky. All the way down. Roll it all the way down. That's it. Now come all the way up. Bring those fists in towards your chin. Come all the way down. Squeeze that core. Vertebrae by vertebrae. Punch it up. And all we go. Here we go. That's it. Now come down to halfway. And you're just going to punch right in between your knees. Now lean back just a little bit further. Come on, get that core engaged. Oh yes. Woo! Getting that sweat on. We got sweaty today. We tested our brain. We're working the core. Okay, now come back. Bring those feet together. Lift those feet up. And now punch it out. That's it. Added challenge to lift those heels off. Now take it over to the right side. Get those fists back in towards your chin. Now bring it back to the center. That's it. Now take it over to the other side. Yes. Come back to the center. Now can you punch up to the sky? Woo. Oh yes, lean back a little bit further. Now bring it in and extend. Hold those fists right here. Bring those knees in towards your chest and extend nice and long. Here we go. Smile through it. We've got one more track after this. We're going to bring up onto our feet and extend those legs, flex those feet. Three, two, one. Hold and release. Okay, quick little ab workout there for you. We're going to come all the way up to the top. Final, final part. Are you ready? Okay, we're going to take it down and we're going to squat across the mat. Okay, so we're going to kind of cool down here at the same time, but we're going to do a little bit. You're going to come right here. You're going to take it into a little jump. Oh, yes, if you're not jumping today, all you need to do is either come up onto your toes or you can take it into a squat. So walk across. Here we go. Walk across. Little jump. That's it. Get nice and low. Push that booty back and jump it up. Oh, yes. Frosty the snowman. Here we go. That's where we go. we got Frosty the snowman right here. Okay. Now take it over to that side and just jump for three, two, one. One, come all the way back over to the other side. Here we go, four, three, two, one. Back over to the other side. And again, three, two, one. All the way back over to the other side. Last time, let's go, four, three, two, one. Come back to the center. Okay, you're gonna take a nice wide squat. So you're gonna punch right across. Take it slow and controlled. So underneath and then pulling that core in. That's it. Take it all the way across. Punch it out. Pushing those knees and getting nice and low. Oh, yes. Here we go. I don't think Alfie's woken up yet. 
Actually, you don't know, unless he's on the sofa, I think you might still be asleep. Here we go. Take it across. <laughs> Woo! Right, now just take it over to one side. Here we go. Now get low in that lunge. Punch it forwards. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Take it all the way nice and slow. And over to the other side. Lunge it out. That's it. Pull that core in nice and tight. Lean forward just a little bit more for five, four, three, two, one. Come all the way back to the center and take it back out again. Swoop it down and out we go. Yes. Pull that core in nice and tight. Take it across the body and punch it out. Come back to the center. Sway from side to side. Oh yes. Get those inner thighs on fire. And come to a still position in the middle and just punch straight out in front. And now try and twist in that core. That's it, so you're just taking, take it on that axle from side to side. Get down even lower. Last 20 seconds, everybody. Come on, get down towards your edge. Breathe. Woo! Punch it down to the ground. Yes, I got this. Woo, change your state to have a great day. Five, four, three, two, one. Come all the way back to the center. Bring those fists up. Squeeze those elbows. Pulse it out. And release. Yes, we did it. Oh my goodness. Like a good old 30, 32 workout right here. Oh my goodness, my inner thighs are going. You guys done such a great job. Let's stretch it out. I'm gonna do one little stretch and then make sure that you do the full cool down video that I put up after this. So bring that knee in towards your chest. Just bring that knee underneath your armpit. Flex the foot, rotate left, rotate right. Feel that stretch on the inner thigh. Oh my goodness, this feels so good. Okay, all the way over to the other side. So bring that knee in, relax the shoulders on the ground. Here we go, inhale and exhale, bring in that elbow, tuck it, your knee into that elbow and feel that stretch right here, so you're kind of bringing the knee into the armpit and then bring both knees in, give yourself a little squeeze and come all the way up, alright, make sure that you do a proper cool down, alright, make sure you're doing a really great cool down, how does everybody feel, how does everybody feel? <laughs> <laughs> Imagine coming downstairs on Christmas and seeing some random lady punching the air. That's what we're all about. I can't believe we did it. I did it. Yes, amazing. Yes, I abs. I can do. Keep moving. Okay. I know there was a little bit of i uh, I'm like a pro fighter here. Yes, you go, Eva. <laughs> Love this. Thank goodness you can't see me, Terry. Look, it's all about having fun. And look, if you were moving all over the place and you were at least just smiling and laughing at yourself, that is okay, right? That's what it's all about. It's just having fun and not taking yourself too seriously. I've been to some dance castings where I don't even know how I got the confidence to even show up because I was absolutely terrible, but I did anyway. And you know what? It doesn't matter if I was gonna get rejected or not. I had fun, I like to dance. You guys like to work out. It's just testing a different part of your muscle, testing a different part of your brain. All right, tap, tap, I love this. Tap, tap, got it. Uh, Re replace the side tap with an uppercut. Wow, Anastasia's on fire. Let's see, my brain doesn't like this. I'm not coordinated. It's funny with this holiday music, I know. It's okay, look, we did the best that we could. We did something different today. We did something new, right? It was fun. That was so fun. I know, they go so fast. So, so, so far, fast. So, who wants to know? The winners of yesterday's prize. Oh my goodness me, I just absolutely love going through and seeing all of these things that you're grateful for. It's so fun to, I just love reading it. It's like my evening little ritual. I get to go on, find out more about you guys. So yesterday, we gave away another one of the Inner Transformation programs. And who, I need some drum rolls, guys. Guys and girls, you know when I say guys, by the way, I'm saying girls, I'm, I just grew up, it's guys and girls. But we have got two people that we are gonna give away 
the Inner Transformation Program, which is worth over $500. Right now, though, everybody, it is 80% off. So if you go to RebeccaLouiseCoaching.com, you want a program that's going to help with your mindset at the beginning of 2021. You want to go through a transformation. There's something that you're trying to break free of right now. There's some goal that you want to try and accomplish. All of these things are going to give you the foundation to help you get there. And I lead the whole thing. We do it as a community. It's like working by yourself, but together. And we get to do this all over the world. And so it doesn't matter what time zone you're in. Okay, here we go. The winner of the Inner Transformation Program from day, I don't even know what day it was. Was it day nine, day 10? Day nine, day nine goes to Maria Rocks. Woo, and her Instagram is Roxy. Yeah, I just loved reading all about you and her friends. Katrina, who is K8 underscore Steph, who I believe might also do the workouts because she follows me. So congratulations to Maria and Katrina. If you guys are on the line, I need you to make yourself known. Who are you? Where are you? I want to see where you guys are. It is Maria. Her name is Roxy. Yeah. Woo! Yeah, it's so exciting. Where is she? Just say, I am here, I am here. If this is you, and we are giving away our next prize. Woohoo! Congratulations, everybody. Say congrats to our girls, Maria and Katrina. Super excited for you guys. I know that she's been on a lot of the lives. Where is she? Where is she? There she is. It's me. Yes, look how excited she is. Congratulations, Roxy. We're so proud of you. We're so grateful for you. Everybody who's been contributing over the last like 10 days, nine days, how, how many days we've been doing this, we're so appreciative of you. You're literally creating so much fun and so much energy. And that's what is really bringing all of this to life, right? That's what it is. It's us bringing our energy and having it together. So I'm super proud of you guys. And now I am going to post today's giveaway. And what I'm going to be doing today is it's all about the season of giving and giving back. So today, all you got to do is you got to head on over to my Instagram post that I am just posting right now. You've got to answer the question in the description and then just tag your friends. And the more times that you comment, the more friends that you tag, the more chance that you have to win. And today's prize is I'm going to give you guys $50 each to give to your favorite charity. So if there was a time to tag your friends, your charities, to get everything involved, like this is what today's prize is. So I was thinking about, you know, what it is that can we can give, how can we give as a community. So I hope that you enjoy today's prize. You know, I wrote a little bit in there about a, a, another organization that I am supporting, but I wanted to help you guys to give back this year so all of us can give back together. So go ahead and comment right now. Where is everybody? Where I can see you guys are already commenting. Amazing. So head on over to my Instagram post. I'm going to put it up on my Facebook as well so that you can post it. You can tag your friends on the Facebook post. You can let them know. You can enter that way. Uh, but I thought that that was a, just a really nice way to start our week is to give away to a charity. So I am so... Yay, I'm excited. I'm glad that you love this as well. Look, remember, if you're like, hey, I've commented on everything else, this $50 could actually go and help somebody even more in need of me and you and some of your friends and family. So it will be donated in your name. So it will be your donation. Uh, you'll be able to say, this was me that donated it. I was the one uh, and give you the recognition for it, of course, because you did the work to make it happen. So make sure that you tag people so we can get $50 in your name to a charity of your choice. So for whichever charity it is, it will be donated in your name. Oh my goodness, this is amazing. Incredible, incredible, incredible. So I will see you for tomorrow. We've only got three days left. Do not drop now. Do not go anywhere right now. Now is the time to keep on going. And remember the last day, we're gonna have a little chat at the end. I want you guys to give me all of your ideas, thoughts, whatever it is that you want for January 2021 challenge. It's gonna be epic. If it's anything like this, it's gonna be unreal. So thank you for joining me. I hope that you enjoyed testing your brain on this Monday morning to start the new week with. And I will see all of you, my favorite people in the world. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Love you.